it's be kind of neat, you know. It just has different ideas, and I thought it was really cool. So I thought I would put those in with my um, books. And then this, these are just some cards that I got previously at a, another yard sale. And I cut what I, the pictures out that I wanted because these are a bunch of get well cards and I didn't want to use those. So I cut those out. And, oh, here's a stamp that I have. And... This right here is a book I took apart because it was already, the, pay, the cover was already off of it. And I decided that I was going to use these pages in a book. Because, I mean, look at those illustrations. You, you can cut the saddle out or, you know, a horse picture out and put it in your books that way. And they're vintage looking too, so that was kind of cool. And so I just cut that book up. I, I think I gave one just like it to a friend of mine because she wanted it. Um, but this one, I'd ar it was already it was already the cover was off of it, and so I just like tore the pages out. And so that's that's what I'm doing here. Yeah, let me just see here. I'm just trying to. Go to my Facebook page and let somebody know I'm live. Just to throw it out there. Hmm. Let's see here. Here we go. Check me out. Oh, I'll say check YouTube. All right, so isn't that cool? I wish I could do type faster. Oops, and then I made a mistake when I did that. Somebody called me and asked me if I would come work, but they wanted me to come next Saturday, and next Saturday I made plans to go to the ocean. Check YouTube, Mary Kate is live right now. You guys probably yell at me. I know you're live, Mary Kay. I got together with Anna today. That was fun. We went and had coffee at Starbucks. And um, then we went to um, Fred Meyers. Because the Starbucks was right there in Fred Meyers. And so we went there. And I'm just trying to get toward my channel here. Alright, there I am, live. Okay. So, so this is, anyway, so then we went and, um, live. Okay. Oh. So, so this is, <laughs> yeah. anyway, so then we went and. I took my yard sale video down because it was upside down. So I will show you live my yard sale video. So here's here's the um I got a book like this. And it had it had a, several of these pages in it. It didn't have like this one or this one in it, but see and, and you guys are looking at it and it's upside down. <laughs> I have to, I took it down because it was upside down. So I'm sorry, I'm going to switch you around and make you right side up without turning you off. Sorry for the, well, at least I didn't make you dizzy, right? There. Now I got to move you over. Sorry for the wiggle. All right. There, now it's upside right. <laughs> there. 
So, anyways, it, so when I put downloaded it, it it was upside down, and I was like, oh, I hate watching videos that are upside down. So this has oh, that's upside down now too. Um, this has like you know it's a color me thing, so it has all different um, things in it, chameleons and. And turtles and all sorts of things so that's I got that and I, t I cut the lion one out and I cut the I, I'm gonna give this to my friend it's a peacock because she's um, somebody at her work called her a peacock so I thought oh okay I'm gonna give this to her and then um, the other thing I got is I got this Thing. So this would be really good for like, you know, like Liz's Big Fatty or, you know, the other gal, that Pink Poodle that does a Big Fatty. So I thought that would be cool. I could, you know, either put new pages in there or just use the ones that are in there. Because how many cookbooks can you have, right? And then the other thing I got was choo -choo, was Donald Duck, another little golden book, and this Animal Babies. Look at these pictures. The illustrations are so cool. Look at them. They're so cute. I can cut them out and use them. Hi, Susan! Oh, Susan. The other thing I found. Hold on a second. No, it's not in this one. It's in this one. The other thing I found at the yard sale was tongue twisters. And I just happened to go to this one. Hold on one second. Where is it at? I'm just flipping through the pages here. I don't know where it was that one. Maybe it was right in the beginning. I don't know. Oh, yeah. A proper copper coffee pot. Sue chews string cheese. Bruce bought bad brown bran bread. Four famished French fishermen flying, frying flying fish. <laughs> I saw that and I thought the the proper co copper coffee pot and then the next line was Sue. <laughs> I thought, okay, there we are. <laughs> Sue's drinking her coffee. I'm gonna put you twist you guys a little bit so that you can see more what I'm doing instead over in the junk area. And I spilled my water on the floor and it's cold. You ain't ever trying that, huh? Then I got these Daffy's Tongue Twisters. Daffy Fleas 55 Fierce Flying Fireflies. <laughs> oh, look. This is one of those flip ones. Uh, let me see. <laughs> Remember those? I can't see it, huh? The first time you could see it. I saw it the first time, right? Let's try it one more time. Oh. It's, it's, he goes backwards this way. <laughs> I know, weren't those cool? <laughs> Anyways, so and then I was looking at the baby, little baby animals. Look at that little colt. Oh, and an elephant. The elephant looks furry. I like this one with the birds. And little turtles and little gators and cro crocodiles. Oh. So this morning I got up early and, and um, went to the chiropractor 
and then went and saw, um, oh, what's her name? Anna. And you guys know Anna. She comes on here every once in a while. She lives in Puyallup. So her and I went for coffee. That's what I was saying when you guys came on. So, and then I got this Anna Green Gables cookbook. And I thought it'd be really cool, you know, to um, put some of these in the thing. But maybe I'll just, I don't know. It's hard to, hard to take away. Oh, but, oh, I had to show you this, though. Remember, I don't know if you've ever read the story, but remember when um, Anna's best friend came over and they were drinking... Um, Diana Berry's favorite raspberry cordial. But they were drinking the liquor kind of cordial. They got it mixed up with raspberry wine. <laughs> yeah. I don't know that she cooked much, but, you know, um, I think she mostly wrote stories. <laughs> Do I have the autofocus on? No. And just not focusing. You know what? I forgot to change the setting on the um the poor thing. Remember I was telling you about that. Let me see if it has a I'll sharpen it. That's what I'll do. Is that better? Is that more clear? I did the sharpen. Or does that just make it even see my shadows more? Now that didn't work. <laughs> let's try it again. Oh, let's see here. Alright, so... Sorry, I'm shaking it. I'm like talking and it's shaking. Do they have the vertical mirror? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll know when you start moving. I don't have an autofocus on it because it's not it's not a camera. It's um it's a uh Phone. Definitely the right knob is okay. <laughs> well, how about we do this? Maybe it's bring it down closer. Here, hold on. Whoops, dropped you. <laughs> oh. oh, you know what? No. <laughs> I have to move this thing back. There, let's try that. I found, which I think is really cool, is this Raggedy Ann Secret. It's like an old-timey Raggedy Ann. The pages are ripping. So I found that one. It's a it's a um, wonder book. So, pretty cool. And the other golden book I found is this one. The Lord is my shepherd. And I think that's all the golden books I found. 
But anyways, so I was creating a a Happy Meal pack because I was like thinking, I got to get rid of some of this stuff. I'm buying too much. Well, the other thing I found another day, well, I got Ping. Oh, look, I got an Anne of Green Gables book. So maybe I should do the Anne of Green Gables book. Green Gables, look. I could do a um, journal with Anna Green Gables. Who knows? I don't know what I'll do. I love Anna Green Gables. That was one of my favorite books. Oh, oh and I got that. Mm. I'm just like looking around my room and I'm like, okay, what's in that bag? What's in that bag? I got all these little grab bags. Ooh. It's garbage, darn it. <laughs> Let's see, what's in this bag here? Oh, my friend, she loves pink champagne cake. One day I'm going to make it for her. I got envelopes. What else do I got? Oh, see, this is where I found the cards. So I was taking the cards and cutting the pictures that I liked out of them. But all these cards, they're all get well cards. Oh, look, I could use that one in the kitty one. So I don't want to use get well cards. So I don't know, maybe I'll. I like that pot, though. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'll have to cover it up. Hi, Malia. I'll just have to cover that little spot up because I want to use this. So I'll just rip this. Oh, see, there's a little one on the back. And it's illustrated by Mary X whatever. Her name. Good name. I'll take that for my kitty cat book. And where's my... And then take... I guess... I know, I'll, I'll just cut... <laughs> I'll cut it out and use that one. <laughs> and then I can use the envelope for something else. And see, now that one's really pretty. But I don't think I'm going to cut that one. I think I'm going to pass it on. I mean, look at all these. There's like a ton of get well ones. I don't know. That one's pretty. So I'm going to just cut off the top. Just rip this one. Put it up there. Keep the envelope. Toss that. See, now that's a pretty one. You gotta ruin it with a good well wish. <laughs> Get well wish. <laughs> Put a frog in the hole. They really stay. Oh, there you go. Yeah. That's a good one. Put a frog in the hole. Frog in the hole. Oh. Now this one is real cute. Cute. Here's a hug. I love Susie Sue. To help you feel better. Well, I'll save that one because I like Susie Do Zoo. Susie Zoo. And this one. This one looks out of focus. I'll just pass that on. Pass it on. Pass it on. I'll let somebody else deal with it. Put it in the Happy Mail. <laughs> the Happy Mail. I want them to get well, right? I'll put those up there. And these. And this over here. Oh, I don't want them to get well. Throw the get well in the garbage. Because we're not sick. We're well already. This in the garbage. And put these books 
over here. I need, I got so many books. I, uh, look, I got this book. It's a harmony book. And I got this wildflower one. I got the Journal of Notary. I got Standard Better Hymns. Sing the songs. Oh, you have a young raccoon. Oh, with a possum friend. Look, I got more cards. Let's see what these are. I think I've already showed you these guys. I sure would like to see you get well. But if I can't make it over there, please go ahead without me. <laughs> oh, see, now I already cut one of those out. Yeah, and this one's sympathy. Or just a note card, I don't know. Oh no, Gail, you're going to be awake for a while? You know, you must know your prescriptions. Alright, so. So these are, oh, how did that get in there? We'll put that over there. This one I like this. Read my lips. Read my lips. Get well soon. this get well too these are yep get well soon all of these cards are get well soon I'm going to put them in this envelope maybe I should have a yard sale on. Yep, 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 there we go maybe I should give them to my friend Kathy everybody her work is sick Ooh, isn't this pretty? What does it say? Get well. <gasps> it says, may you be feeling better soon. You might better. Ooh, look. Paper that has lines on it. Ooh, I like that. Oh, is there something I was going to use that for? Oh. The house my grandpa built. Oh, I need to put that in my shop. I wonder how much I should sell that for. Does anybody recognize that? Oh, look, it says Suze. S-U-Z-E. Suze. Should I send it to Suze? Oh, my goodness. You had hives every day last year? Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at that puppy. We're not going to... And he's a postcard. But I'm going to cut him out. He's cute. He's a cutie pie. He's so cute. He needs to be in a happy card, not a sad card. All my days. You're so cute. I like that puppy. Isn't that a cute puppy? He don't need to be on no get well card. He needs to be on a happy card. These are... Oh, these are note cards. Okay. I'm going to put those up in my note, note card box. Oh. You know what I did earlier? I spilled some water on the floor, and it's cold. Well, look, here's some Velveeta. I need that for my stuff. I guess it's still that way. All right, what else is in here? Oh, a 
Oh, this is my grocery bag farm art. Isn't that funny? That needs to be passed on to somebody who has kids. Malia! That's a good one. You got kids. Oh, look what I found. Doilies. They're the plastic ones. So they make great, um, whatchamacallits. Oh, look, here's a journal. Great stencils. Then I just got a bunch of paper stuff. Paper sleeves in here. You know what I use these for? I use them for, um, they're sleeveys, so I put my arms in them. I'm just kidding. <laughs> they're, they're monitorizing you, Susan. Remember those ugly plastic sticky doilies on your furniture? Yeah, these things. That's what they are, is those ugly plastic doilies. They make, they're perfect for stenciling. I know, I use the page protectors in my, um, my, um, journal, um, or my, you know, where I keep my magazines. I put them in there. I put my magazine stuff in there. And I put them, I use them in my shop too, because if I decide I have too much stuff, and then I put a bunch of pages in there, and they, they make great, um, oh, what do you call them? Um, great bags <laughs> for, for, uh, uh, for paraphernalia for your journals. That's what I mean. So, anyways. So, look, there's a cow ear. It's a cow's ear. From a cow farm. Anyways. But his, this is a trivet. It's kind of trivial. Plastic would be better for what? Oh, yeah. These would be really good for stenciling, I think. You know, and this, I saw it at the yard sale, and I thought, oh, that's a cool stencil. <laughs> Not doilies, right? So my bag, I think, is empty. Oh, look, I found a, a clip for my Cheetos. A clip for my Cheetos. <laughs> I was eating those Cheetos and after a while they they seemed like they were really full of grease. It was gross. Gross grease. Oh, look. There's some. Oh, this must just be garbage. I think I just threw that in there because it was garbage. All right, so I cleared that sack out. Let's see here. I don't know what I'm going to do with all that stuff. But I got so many bags here. I mean, look, I got this. I think what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to make a little book and put it inside there. And then sell it. Oh, you think paint through it? Or sprays. Sprays would do really good with this. Sprays would be really good with that. Yeah, yeah, I got so much stuff in here. I got a, I got stuff that I need to... Here's my little red wagon. Stuff I need to take to my shop. And... 
oh, see, I got this for when I was going to use a different camera. And I have this camera. See, I have one of these. One of these, but I couldn't figure it out. You know, I don't know. So I got one of those, and I got a camera. And then I just, my husband bought a new phone, so I stole his phone. I stole his phone! But look at this. If somebody has room on a cabinet, it's perfect to put all your little things in it. Yeah, see? Put all sorts of things in here. Look, here's a toothpaste holder. Toothbrush holder. Oh. And I got the paper bag princess. The paper bag princess. Well, that's really weird. I need to separate this stuff. I got Garfield. I got 20th Century Children's Treasury. I don't know why I bought that. <gasps> oh, the little ducklings. There once was a little duckling. Oh, this is cute. Hold on. Let me move my menagerie here. Oops, I didn't break it. Look, isn't that cute kitty? <laughs> yeah, these are this is a junk journal um utensil holder. So you just put your little brushes in there. And your, um, what else? Oh, yeah. Your little pokey tools. Just put it right in there. And then, if you need some paint, put your paint in here to, oop, that paint's not going to fit. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We'll put your paint in there. Oh, that's not going to fit no more either. Uh, anyways, you see you can put stuff in there. Oh, you can put your scissors in there. Alright, go go eat and get ready for bed. I know, isn't that the cute kitty? <laughs> yeah, put your scissors in there. Pokey duel in there. Yeah. Or you could put toothpaste right there. Toothpaste and your toothbrushes. It would work too. And I got this. I should take these to my shop. Huh? I'm gonna take this to my shop. Or should maybe I should put it on my fence. I don't know. Oh, sorry, I gotta get the bag out so I can put them in there. So I don't know which one it is. Ugh. I've been cleaning, you know, but not really. So here's this is a oh, look what I found too. I need to price these guys individually. All these trolls. And I got oh, my granddaughter's birthdays the same day as mine. Right, so I got a giraffe. Got a lion. Got a gray ape. Ape, an ape. A great ape. Got a monkey. Maybe that's an ape too, I don't know. 
got a lion and a deer. Another lion and another giraffe and a hippo. Oh, rhinoceros and a monkey and uh, another lion. So I got a whole menagerie of animals, which I'm going to give to my granddaughter. I think I'll give them to her for her birthday. She'll like them. And then I got some, um, I got a um, gazebo. She'll use these animals in her um, fairy land. She has like a little fairy land. So I'll give her those. Oh, and I forgot I got her these. These are those. Um, I know. I ain't worried about it. my birthday's not till next Wednesday. But if you don't get a birthday card out to me, I'm not worried about it. Cause saying happy birthday is good. So I got these these dolls for there's like a little I think these dolls are normally pretty expensive. One there. And this one. There's a little boy doll. And another little girl doll. So, I got her those dolls. Which I am going to put. I got these bags, but had a Ziploc one. There, that's what I want. Is a zip oh, here's a Ziploc one. That's the big one. That's what I want. I'm going to put them in the big Ziploc for the, the granddaughter. Put the and the animals in there. And I think I have horses, too. Oh, I have this car. It's all broken. I didn't even realize it was broken, and I bought it. Like, I think I'm just going to toss it because it's broken. Somebody else can deal with it. I think I paid pennies on the dollar. Oh, look what I found. It's not um, Golden Book, but it's a little red hen. I'll just go through that. It's a little red hen. And then I got these hinges at this one place because I want to do make one of those book. Um, it's a book book um, house. And here's another troll. Not in there. And here's another troll. And another troll. Garbage. Oh, another troll. And then I got this because I thought it looked cool. But I don't know what it's for. You know, it, it was hanging. Maybe it hangs. I don't know. Maybe you could hang like. You put it on your wall something and then you hang something off of it I don't know I don't know what it is but I liked it it won't go in a book yeah you like trolls oh and I got this wire this um spishing wire thinking that I could use it in my books oh here's another troll so Oh, and then I got this car. Oh, this was a, a car. 
the king. Anyways. So, now I'm going to put the, all the trolls. All the things back in this one bag so I can price them. See here. This. And put them in my shop. I, I picked up a... What did I pick up? I picked up a... I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I can't remember what I picked up. Oh, must have been a brain fart. <laughs> I can't think what I picked up. I picked up a lot of stuff. So, anyways, all those trolls. This one glows in the dark. So I'm going to put those trolls in my shop. Put the kitty in my shop. Put this... I don't know if I'm going to put that in there. It, it it had held cards. I don't know. I might make a book and put it. These are kids of books. Okay. Alright. Those will be right there until I do that. i got to figure out what to do with all these books. I'm just, I, I'm just like a book hoarder. all your guys' fault. <laughs> Look at all these books. I just need to start crafting with them. Oh, I was going to show you. Um, I got all these little horses for my granddaughter. Can you see them? All the little horses. It's like, I can take them out of the back because I got another bag. So look, oh, that's a pretty one. And that one. This one. This one's furry. That's a furry one. Yeah. That one looks like a mule. Donkey, donkey, donkey. Horse, horse. So anyways, I got her all these horses. She'll like those. And then, here's some more dolls. Last week I brought her um, a bunk bed for her bigger dolls. She goes, Grandma, I already got a bed for my dolls. Look at that hair. <laughs> Horse of a different color. Oh, look. She looks like one of the um, minion girls or something. There's that girl and that girl and this old lady. <laughs> looks like one of us. So she can all those dolls. Like, Grandma? She got so many toys. <laughs> she has like one, two, three grandmothers. Yeah, three grandmothers. So she has a lot. So that'll be fun for her to. They'll probably sell it in their next garage sale or something. <laughs> oh my goodness. I know. Or lots of horses of different colors, huh? So this one, somebody said they liked Hanny Penny. Oh, the little red hen. This is not Hanny Penny, though. The sky is not falling. This is the little red hen like the other one I did. Oh, well. Because they said, not I, not I, not I. All right. Look at all these books. Anybody want some books? Books, books, I got the books. I just go hog wild. They have a, a book thingy down at the corner. I think I'll take some of the books like Ping.
That was your favorite little golden book, huh? And I haven't seen Hanny Penny yet. Yet, you know, because you know I have a lot of books. I think I'm going to take this one down to the, to the thing, to the thing. <laughs> I can't think of the thing. Oh, my goodness. Put that one down there. I have a singer book. Garfield's Picnic Adventure. Maybe I'll take that one down there too, because I don't really. Garfield and I. Garfield was born on my birthday, June nineteenth. All right. So. Oh my word! I just go too hog wild. Hog wild. Isn't there a song like that or something? I also bought this, brought this, bought this, brought, I bought that in the garage sale. All right. I'm going to put those books somewhere. Probably on my table that's about ready to fall because all the books are on it. <sighs> Too many books. Okay. I was thinking about putting the little golden books into a, uh, um, like a kit, you know, putting like all different things and then adding a little golden book to the kit and just saving the golden books if I only have one each of them and then getting rid of the rest. I might put them in my shop. Somebody said they put $5 each on them. I think I'll do that. Put $5 each on my little golden books and get them. Move them out. Move them out. You want craft with them? Hmm. I know. I was thinking a good idea for kids. So. Any of the books I have, I can gift out for a kit. You know? Look at this. This is just a bag of stuff that I was going to use or I have used. Like, look, this one has one of those envelopes in it. Also has Christmas stuff and ribbon. So I could just put that in an envelope and Mail it off to somebody because it has a lot of goodies in it. Right? And then I have these little background pieces I made. <laughs> I don't know. It's funny because you, you take the stuff that you have to make other stuff to, to use it up. But then what do you do with the other stuff? <laughs> yeah, I should focus on my shop. It's hard focusing on my shop. But I will. <sighs> well, anyways, everybody. Have a blessed day. It was fun. I love showing you my books. <laughs> I should read another tongue twister before I go. Let's see, how about this one? This is a two-tongue two twister poem. An oyster met an oyster, and they were oyster too. Two oysters met two oysters, and they were oysters too. Four oysters met a pink milk, and they were oyster stew. <laughs> Bye. See you guys later. Have a great day. Thank you for coming.